Good morning, boys and girls. This week, we are speaking about South African money. So all the money that we have, we're going to look at now, and then we're going to have a look at what color, what animal, and what shape goes on which banknote. So we're not going to look at all of the money in this video that was on a previous video, but we're going to look at just the notes now, and we're going to look at the animals, the colors, and the shapes, the 2D shapes. So our first note, and this is play money, as I showed you in the last video. It's got play money across it because we're not allowed to copy money. You see lots of movies where they copy money and then it's illegal. And as I explained to you, the ladies in the shops, the cashiers or the men, they hold up the money to that UV light to see that it has that silver thread or the watermark that it's not fake money. So this is the 10 Rand note and it's green. So we'll look at all of them. The 20 Rand note, brown. 50 Rand note, like a reddish pink color. And the 100 Rand note is blue. I'm going to move that up. And the last one is our 200 Rand note. It's like an orangey brown color. So now let's have a look at the notes and what their colors are. So the 10 Rand note is green and the animal on it we've got the word play money through the animals unfortunately but the animal on these notes the one on the ten ren note is the rhino and I discussed with you that our money has our big five. One, two, three, four, five. These are the animals of South Africa that people come to the Kruger National Park to see. And unfortunately, they are poached, but these are proper South African animals that are indigenous to South Africa. They live in South Africa. They are born here and you can see them in zoos in the rest of the world, but they belong to us, they're South African animals. So on the 10 Rand note, it's green, and the animal is the rhino. And then the 2D shape is the diamond. And we can't really see it on this play money. And remember I said when people try and copy money, that's why they make it so detailed and they've got all different things that people need to copy in order for it to be look real. And that's why they make it quite difficult. So the shape normally goes on the side here. And if you've got a real note of any one of these, you can have a look. And so those are the three things we're looking at. Color, green for the 10 Rand note the rhino and the diamond is your 2D shape. Then your 20 Rand note is your, oh, and we write it like this, 10 Rand. Right, and we call it a note because it's a paper money. Then 20 Rand. is brown and the animal is the elephant and its shape is a square. It's 
So there we've done the 10 and the 20. Let's go on to the 50. So the 50 is like a reddish color. The animal is a lion and it's the 50 rand note. And the shape is a circle. And remember, these are all 2D shapes. They're flat on the notes. They don't have any other dimensions like our 3D shapes, our space shapes that we learnt in the second term. And the 100 rand note is like a bluish purplish colour. And the animal is the buffalo. And it's 100 rand, that's how we write it, with a capital R. And the shape on this is the hexagon, but it's the flattish one. But remember I said to you, as long as it's got six sides, one, two, three, four, five, six sides, it's a hexagon. And now I'm going to have to squeeze in unless I'm going to write on my table, which I don't really want to do. So, the last note that we have, our biggest note, is 200 Rand. Okay, and our fastest animal goes for our biggest note, is the leopard. And I'm incorrect. It's not our fastest animal because I was looking at its spots, but I forgot to have a look. It doesn't have its tears. So this isn't our fastest animal, but it is our biggest note and it is our leopard. Which is our fastest animal? Correct, the cheetah. So the leopard has shorter legs than the cheetah, but it is still one of our big five. And it is on the 200 rand note, and the shape is the other hexagon. One, two, three, four, five, six sides. So one last look. We have a green note for the 10 rand. It has a rhino with the diamond. A brown note for the 20 rand. It has an elephant and the square. The reddish pinkish note for the 50 rand. Has the lion in a circle. Blue purpley colour for the hundred rand note, the buffalo, and the hexagon. And then our biggest note is two hundred rand. The leopard and the hexagon shape. So let's go through it in the book where they haven't, oops, sorry, where they haven't done let's have a look at it like that. They haven't done the notes, but they've just done the animal and the shape. So the 10 rand note, the rhino and the diamond. What color is the 10 rand note? Correct. It is green. Let's put that
Then the 20 rand note, elephant, the square. What color is that? Correct, it is brown. I'm going to have to overlap them a little bit like that. Then the 50 rand note, the lion in the circle. Color, reddish pink. In the 100 rand note, animal is the buffalo and the hexagon. What color? Correct, purpley blue color. And our last biggest note is the 200 rand. It's our leopard, the hexagon shape, and it's like an orangey color. And there we go. So now you're going to try and remember all that we saw in this video, and then you're going to try and answer the questions that I've put on your home learning program for today on our money and our notes.